Hey, what's going on guys? This is Adam from GHL Mastery. I've been in the GHL space for the better part of five years and spent the last three years coaching and teaching people how to use the high level platform at an extremely high level. And in this video is part two of our ongoing series, the high level masterclass, where we are going to teach you absolutely everything that you need to know about the high level ecosystem so that you can leverage it to make more money for your agency and for your clients. In this video, we're gonna be covering the company settings, which is how you can set up your white label agency in the high level ecosystem, turn on specific notifications, turn on specific custom actions and rebilling actions for your clients. Also guys, if you want early access to all of these videos, we're gonna be dropping these out probably once a week um, as we go along here. But if you click the link down below, you can actually get access to the full raw unedited version of the course that exists already inside of our GHL Mastery membership area completely free. And also if you find these videos helpful, don't forget to subscribe for more of this content so that you guys can learn and master the high level platform for yourselves. Let's dive into it. All right guys, continuing with the boring but necessary stuff within the high level ecosystem, we're gonna start talking about your company settings and what you can do with these. First of all, upload your logo. This logo right here is gonna show up and display in this top bar right here. So this is gonna be your white label agency logo that all of your clients are going to see. Do your best to get a 350 by 180 pixel image so that it'll automatically up go, go up in this corner right here. Set up your company name. Your company email is gonna be your default email that you signed up with, as well as your company phone number. That's gonna be the default phone number that you signed up with. Company website, it may not exist yet, so for you can leave it alone for now, but obviously, ours does so we put it in here as well business category do your best to find one that fits you a lot of us are agency owners and so we are in the agency space or creative space and then our business niche personally is software company but you can set that to whatever you want based on what your company does what are you primarily using high level for this is just a throw in um, we're white labeling and reselling the software ourselves this is where the the stuff comes in that's very very important to creating a white label agency for high level is that you you need to know and understand how to manage domains. So I'm gonna do three separate videos showing you the three most common domain registrars that we use and that we see. But the important part is that you need to set up your white label domain so that instead of your users going to app.gohighlevel.com, they are going to go, and in our case, it's app.nurturebox.com to log in. So that is what your white label domain is. And in order to set that up, you can click right here for your setup instructions. And this is gonna walk you through exactly what you need to do to set up your white label domain. But don't worry guys, if you're a visual learner, I'm gonna be covering this in both Cloudflare, Namecheap and GoDaddy to show you guys exactly how to do that. Next up is your API domain. Now this one confuses an awful lot of people. What is an API domain? An API domain is essentially the domain that is going to be the default domain for all of your sub accounts when they send a link. So when we get into the sub account setup, this will make a lot more sense, but there's a bunch of different links that you can send people. You can send people raw website links. You can send people invoices. You can send people trigger links. You can send all sorts of links within the ecosystem of high level. And this API domain link is going to be set as the default for every single sub account that you create. But don't worry, we can change this as the branded domain inside the sub account so that it is branded to the company. But this part is really, really important to set up. If you do not set this up, it's going to have a default gray label, high level lead connector link for these links. And so it's very, very important that you do set this up um, for your agency so that your clients have branded domains for your agency until they go and they set up their own domains within the ecosystem. If you've got a privacy policy URL, which you may or may not have yet, um, don't worry, we're gonna have that covered too in later videos. Um, you guys can go ahead and throw your um, URLs in here. Anything terms and conditions you can throw in here as well. These are gonna be available on the login screen at when you set up your white label domain. So if somebody clicks the privacy policy and terms and conditions, that's gonna be the default on the login screen for you. Custom JavaScript, if you're gonna get involved with us or anybody else that does custom CSS, custom JavaScript work, within the high level system. That's gonna make your accounts 
look different, do different things. Um, this is where you're gonna put in a lot of those codes. And again, not super, super important. If you'll notice ours has been the same and looked the same as Go High Level for years. We don't really care about the aesthetic side of things, but this will give you the ability to add buttons and add a whole bunch of new functionality. Um, and a, there's a lot of amazing third-party vendors that do a lot of really cool stuff within the high-level ecosystem. Custom CSS is gonna be the look and feel of your dashboard. So if you wanted to change the colors, you can get somebody to stylize and change the entire look and feel of your high-level white label software so that it doesn't even look like high level. This is where you're gonna plug that in. Now you have a choice with the defaults. You can use light theme or dark theme. I use dark theme for everything. And then obviously once you're done making the changes here, we're gonna click update company. Now guys, I want you to stand on this for just a little bit. We're gonna be going in depth about these two things in the next video, but I want to cover all of the rest of the stuff. Your company address, it's gotta be in there, right? You're gonna be registering your company. So you gotta have an address in there as well. Now, most of these settings I turn off. These are gonna be just notification settings basically for your agency. Net Promoter Score surveys, do you want to receive those Net Promoter Score surveys? Do you want to receive product guidelines inside your agency as notifications? Do you want daily updates? And do you want early access to beta features? So these are personal preferences for you, the agency, to select whether you want these things to be on or off. And these are, again, just notifications from high level to you, the agency. They're oftentimes little pop-ups in the bottom corners over here where my face is, where you're just gonna have to dismiss them, ignore them, or click in and get more information. Next up, this gets missed by a lot of people, and this is, you know, a lot of people will sign in and see a new feature gets launched and they'll say, hey, how come I can't see this new feature in my sub accounts? This is usually the reason why. You oftentimes need to come in and turn these things on and allow them in your sub accounts. So AI employee, again, this is a brand new feature as of for when I'm recording this. So you just come in here and you turn these things on or you turn these things off for your sub accounts. And if you want to allow both your users and yourself to access these things and to be able to resell these things, then you need to turn them on. So it's literally as simple as clicking that toggle, confirming that you want to enable this thing and you are gonna turn it on. And then it's gonna do this. There we go. So yeah, you guys can just decide whether you wanna turn them on or off. Template library, this is gonna give people access to all of the high level templates that exist for funnels, for websites, for email templates, and all of those types of things. Um, depending on what type of agency you plan on running, it might be really, really awesome for you to turn this on and give your clients access to all of it. We run a custom development agency, and so we don't want them to have access to a bunch of templates because we're custom developing everything that we do for our clients, so we just personally turn this off and then enhanced security this is going to be you know 2fa making sure that all your api keys and stuff like that are protected so obviously security is absolutely crucial and important so i recommend that you turn on all of the security features um, that you can within the high level ecosystem so guys that's it for company settings in the next video i'm going to talk to you guys about setting up your white label domain and setting up your api domain and just managing domains in general because you're going to be doing a lot of it so stay tuned for the next one we'll see you there hey guys i hope you found that video useful and helpful for you getting your company set up in high level and getting your white label started with the high level ecosystem now if you're just starting out your journey in the high level ecosystem or maybe you're even an intermediate um, or consider yourself an expert that just wants to know a little bit more about the high level platform and how you can leverage it I would encourage you to go and click the link in the description below this video and hop into our GHL Mastery program. What do we do inside of our GHL Mastery program? Well, we have five calls every single day of the week, Monday through Friday for two hours a day, where we actually help you get into your system, help you build, help you troubleshoot, and just overall help elevate your overall skill set on the high level platform. So if you're interested in getting hands on every single day support plus, a couple of bonus goodies, snapshots, AI systems, the like, then go ahead and click the link below to join our GHL Mastery VIP group. And I promise you, you will learn more in one month than you will in six months doing this on your own. We will see you in the next one. Take care.